You gotta be kidding. Check out the size of this lizard. I've got a great size. Oh yeah, keep it there then. Here, can you hold this camera for me, please? This is a guy fishing. And the torch. So shine the torch on me. Okay. With your head. Yeah, shine it like that, so come right onto me. Yeah, wait up. Shine the torch on me. Out on the fish. Look at that thing. That's a Tonka bud. to another episode of the ghost fishing so today we are chasing flathead um we had a super session yesterday basically we caught five over 70 uh, my son getting his biggest one ever yeah, I didn't go big dog <laughs> hold him and swim him but yeah, put him down. Now swim him. Push him in. What's he done? There she goes. I just casted it, a lady gave me a dry up by the brim, just casted it out, left it out for one minute, one and in and bang, and we got a bull shark. A uh, baby one about that big. So I just landed about an 80 centimetre flathead and then I turn around and my boy's on and he got his biggest ever and um like he said on a butter brim, it was 90 centimetres. I'll put a photo in of that because we didn't have any film and I'm spewing because it was the best session I've had with my son ever. Um, anyway, we'll try again today. We're throwing lures today. We had liveies yesterday and we're gonna go and see if we can get some more of these flathead. Enough of the talking, let's do some fishing. Using a light setup today, I've got six pound um, that's 2,000 frames and this is a new Blades and Tails by Wilson Rod, um, one piece, super epic rod, I like that, I bought that the other day, these live fibers, it's like a samurai but cheaper, um, six pound sunline, he's using like an imitation double clutch, and on his new little rod that he bought, if he hooks a big flathead on that it's going to be fun, alright, Get into it. Slowly climbing in. Okay, going. Yeah. Oh, this way. Slowly. Just go easy on him. Told you that lure would work. Yep. It's nice and easy on him. I think it's the lizard. Yep. Here it comes. Yeah, it's a lizard. Careful, careful, yep. Nah. It's a great oh, you got him up and put my lure away. Fall over, did you? Yeah. There you go, first one. Not a bad I've one. Been before. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's a good flathead, isn't it? Yeah, not as big as the last lot we got. He got a 90 centimetre yesterday. Wow. 
pretty good. I know where to go. Well, I told you that lure would work. Knuckles. How good's that one? I'll get the pliers. Little job for you to do. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. Oh, okay, you want to get him on the release? First fish of the morning. Yeah, it's a beauty. No, go up from behind his back, mate. Go and pinch him from halfway behind his back where he can't spike you. Yeah. Pinch him there. Nice and tight. Now put your hand under his head. Yeah, hold him tight, that's it. Keep him flat so he doesn't spike you. Alright, let's go and release him, eh? It's not a bad little fish. He's not legal size, or...? Yeah, oh, we haven't been eating them, but because of the flood water stuff, so... Oh, right. He's on, again. I'm getting out fish, getting absolutely smoked here. I was trying to catch a mullet there. Yeah, I mean, that's I, all right. Oh, he I might wanted be... a flathead. A different one too. The other one had a weird eye. Do you want to get the hook off, let him go? Yeah, I will. I did How would I catch a mullet when I was whining fast? He might have liked the action. Yeah, so I'm Watch out, it. he'll flip and you'll get them hooks stuck in your hand. Nah. Yeah, try and guts it. Pressure him down so he can't move. Good work. gonna be fun. Here we go. Alright. Finally, I was out and out done by the boy. Good fish. Whatever it is. Oh yeah, it's decent. Imitation double clutch that my mate from work gave me, Tomo. It's just been firing. It's about a 110 mil, I reckon. in for a jewy bait. There we go. Taylor out of all the things. I wasn't expecting that. No, nah, I don't really want to eat the oh, yeah. fish out of here at the moment. I don't. I don't get a hook in my hand in a second. Worst thing about these three-way treble, like three hooks on it, is so many things can go wrong. Getting hooks in your hand. Might have to get me pliers. He's not flipping around at least. Just gotta do it gently. Yes, no hook in the hand. Alright mate, let's get you home. 
on. Oh, we swam up on the beach. There he goes. 